The coolest part of my job is the beautiful view from my office. A marine survey technician does underwater mapping. We map everything from pipelines to subsea construction to bridge platforms to oil platforms and it is very important because without mapping you wouldn't know what's down there. We are doing a pipeline inspection. So what we do is it's a natural gas pipeline that's coming in from the platform. So we do a visual inspection. We have our submarine that goes down. It's got a camera on it so we get a visual of the pipeline or whatever we're mapping. And then we have what's called a multi-beam system. So it sends out thousands of little pings of acoustics. And basically what it does is it makes a map as it goes along the pay is amazing, you get to make a lot of money and when you're on the boat you're not spending any money so you're being fed and you're staying out of trouble but uh, when you get home you have usually a month off or five weeks off so it leaves time in your life for other projects. This job can take you in so many really interesting places. I have a friend, he works down in Hawaii and he just maps the beaches of Hawaii all day. Uh, another person that I know, they work for a shipwreck hunting company. They look for shipwrecks under the water, so you can do treasure, you can do salvage, you can be a marine mammal observer on a boat. There's lots of cool technology that we use. Uh, you know, on our ROV, there's a robotic arm, so it's kind of like playing a video game when you're flying an ROV. Uh, we do a lot of 3D modeling, so we have 3D modeling programs. You can make uh, fly-throughs, which are really cool. You're sort of flying through, it almost looks like mountains, but it's the seafloor. Uh, we have charts that we do, we do up in AutoCAD and that just really exemplifies all the measurements and anything for any underwater construction, what's down there. And it just depends on the client, what the client wants. Being a girl is not the first thing that you should be thinking about. What you should be thinking about are what are your strengths or attributes and applying them to the kind of job that you really like. Uh, careers, they come one day at a time and you're never locked into anything so just go out there and start exploring and uh, get into something that you love.